Almost 30,000 people are still without power in Chatham County six days after Helene ripped through our area. And while thousands of people have had their power restored, the Chatham Emergency Management Agency is still looking to take care of those who haven't been so fortunate. Yeah, this morning Shay Schrader is live at Memorial Stadium, which has already been a hub for community outreach over the last several days. And we know more people will be showing up there again this morning looking for help. Yeah, we've actually already had uh, some people waiting in the parking lot this morning um, as SEMA is preparing to hand out bags of ice as well as food starting at 7 o'clock this morning. Um, like I said, we've had one gentleman come through and start parking and then we've had a couple others. So people are really anxious to get their hands on these bags of ice, which is understandable when you think about the fact that some people in this community haven't had power since last Friday, six days ago when Hurricane Helene came through our area. Now, SEMA will be giving out six seven pound bags of ice. Uh, there is a limit of two per car, and then they're also going to be uh, giving out food starting at 11 AM. That is in limited supply. It is on a first come first serve basis, so just be aware of that. And then they're going to start handing out ice, like I said, at 7 AM, and they're going to end that out at 7 PM this afternoon. Now there is food available at other places um, across the coastal empire. You can see some of those uh, spots on your screen right now, as well as uh, charging and cooling stations to, you know, just soak up some air conditioning, get your devices charged up so you can stay in contact with family members, work, whoever you might need to talk to. There are also four different YMCA locations that are offering hot showers to folks that don't have power, and two of them are also offering food. Now, the assistance to the community continues as President Biden did officially sign a disaster declaration for the state of Georgia yesterday. That means that uh, people in the state and of course in our area are going to be able to start applying for assistance um, for things like repairing their home or getting reimbursement for lodging expenses um, that they've had during the course of the aftermath of Hurricane Helene. We do have more information on that on our website, WTOC.com. Live in Savannah this morning, Shay Schrader, WTOC News.